Hey you guys, we're making a gift basket today and it's gonna be for my godchild. So I picked this basket up from the dollar store. It was just $1, so perfect. So the first thing we're gonna add in there are a pair of shoes that I picked up for him. Timberlands. So I am going to keep the box just in case he does not like them. Look how cute they are. I think they're so cute. Especially since they dress up. They don't dress up as much as they used to. And the dressing room for them now is kind of like casual. So I thought that would be cute. So I thought these would be great in the basket. Like so. How cool is this? This is like a teenager basket. He's a teenager. So we're going to make this work because you know how hard it is to buy anything for teenagers. They just don't like anything nowadays. So we're going to make it work. So let's put that to the side. Can you still see it? Yeah. The first thing I picked up was this adorable shirt and i picked this up at tj maxx for 7.99 so we're just going to take out um how do you do this in case they want to return them do you take out the tag or not like how would you i do that should i leave the tag in case he wants to return it or it just doesn't fit or should i just take the tag off and this is a hard one, but I'm sure this is his size. So we're going to remove the tag. Now I'm going to go ahead and fold this up. Like so. We're going to fold it up really nice. I'm going to show you why. And I'm going to do the same thing to all of them like so and then we're gonna grab the bottom and we're gonna roll it make sure you guys fold the same length for all of them and look how cool this is gonna be now once it's rolled up like that go ahead and grab your string And we're going to cut a piece of the string. I'm not dealing with the knot. So I'm just going to cut it off. And we're going to tie it. I want it to look Christmassy, even though it, it's a taste that they like. I'm gonna grab my scissors and look how cool that is. Did you guys see that? And we're gonna play some like so. So I'm gonna go ahead and do the rest. Let me just show you really quick. I picked up a green plain shirt. These are like nice. And I also picked up another one of the same in blue in case he wants to dress up and i picked up a plain black one a rebox so isn't that cool this is a rebox this is the same one as that one and then another rebox so i'm going to go ahead and do the same thing and i'll come back when i have the piles ready so look how it came out you see how i rolled it up i think that is a perfect way to add clothing to a gift basket and it also looks Christmassy, so I put the two on the back and then the two in the front. Isn't that? That's a good way. You guys don't know that trick. Now you learn something new from me. I'm also going to add this cute plush that I picked up from the dollar store. Isn't that adorable? I'm going to take this one. Bottom 
behind me. But look how cute it is. And that's going to go right there. How cute is this basket coming out? Now he collects Avengers items. And I know the new Black Widow came out. So I picked up the Black Widow. Uh, I'm trying to remove the price really quick before I add it. I picked it up at TJ Maxx, so don't worry about that. The new Black Widow movie came out, so I thought it would be cool to add this to his collection. I'm having a little hard time taking out that receipt. That, um, I said. I'm almost there, you guys. Bear with me. So close. You know how the Black Widow movie came out? So I picked up the adventure toy collection and look at all the rest of them so i can pick up more for him if i want but i know since she's really popular right now i picked her up now i'm trying to clean it up as best as i can it's giving me problems trust me But I think I got it. So I picked this up at TJ Maxx. Right there. So we're going to add her. I think I'm going to add her right here. And add him right there. How does that look? Yeah, I actually think that's coming out too. I picked up his favorite chocolates. How cool is that? Now, I wanted the big box, but this year, unfortunately, I could not find it. That huge box for like $9.99. And this year, I just couldn't get my hands on it. So I had to pick up the smaller size, which is kind of disappointing to me. But, you know, what can I do? So I thought that would be great right there. I'm going to add this adorable ornament that my friend Chrissy made. Chrissy, when my godchild came down last year, he loved it. He said it was so cute and he would love to have one. So I'm happy that you made this and sent it to me because I have quite a few from you. I'm going to give him that one. I think it'll make him so happy. And yeah, she made this. Can you believe that? Look how cute. So I'm going to add this right here. Oopsie if we can I'm gonna add it right there I think that is so perfect okay like so I can even flip the shoes around if I need to but I think the shoes look fine how they are I'm going to add this beautiful money holder look how pretty this is well, I do have other ones. Let me go show you. Because I can always give this one to my mom. I think I'm going to give that one to my mom. And I'm going to add a different one for him. I'm going to add this one. And I also have this one. Oh, they're all so cute. I think I'm going to add this one. I made these, just so you guys know. I make my own money holders and my own gift tags. I'm gonna add a little bit of money in there somewhere, like so. Look how adorable he's going to be so happy with this. So now the question is, um, 
can we fit it in a bag or can we not fit it in a bag because the basket is a little on the wide side so let's go ahead and give it a try i'm gonna go ahead and open the famous bags in the dollar store now i'm gonna try and see if we could fit it in there if not you guys i'm gonna have to take it like that which I don't mind taking it like that. It's pretty packed or it's not gonna move. But I'd rather put it in a bag. So I don't know. We'll see right now. Okay, so if it fits in here, it's not going to fit this way. Well, I don't think it'll fit that way. Let's see. Now, this is a, sorry, a teenager, so. We might be able to get it to fit. Oh, my God. It'll be so awesome. Dollar Tree is the best, I'm telling you. yeah it might actually fit let me play with this really quick <laughs> omg guys it fits so these dollar tree bags are amazing look how cool i mean it is a little tight but nonetheless it fits so with this one i'm gonna go use my little red trucks that i picked up from the dollar store ribbon and it's called farmhouse ribbon just in case and i don't know how it fit but it fits so i'm gonna go ahead Don't cut it in the middle of the truck. Cut it behind the truck. Mm, like so. So let's go ahead and finish this gift basket. Now for this basket, we're not gonna have to cut anything. The green new ribbon. And what we are gonna do is gonna make it a big knot. Now this ribbon is only one-sided, which I hate. When it's only one-sided like this, I wish it would be both sides. At least with a, you know, a different type of ribbon, like you get the back of it as well. But I ran out of this ribbon, so we're gonna have to use this one. So if it shows the trucks, fine. If it doesn't, guys, don't get all scared. Look how cool that is. And I'm shocked that it fit in the basket. You guys, this is awesome for a teenager. You have their clothing, which they're so into. You have a pair of gym shoes. I got Timberlands in there, so they're pricey. I have the chocolate. I have the ornaments. I have the money. And I have a collectible item. So from the top of it, I'm still going to cut a little bit off. Just because I don't want this basket to sag. So I am going to cut some off. To give it less weight at the top. And then I'm just going to fix it like usual. But yeah, I think it came out super adorable, you guys. You know how hard. I'm going to take this. I don't like the way it looks. So just take the edges on there, right into the basket. You see the difference? Oh, sorry. You see the difference between this edge that has nothing and that one that's pointing out? Just go ahead and grab some tape. I'm just super happy that the basket, the bag fit. 
tuck it in and tape it down. And that's it. Make sure the tape holds. Turn it around. And you have a super adorable gift basket for a teenager. He is going to love it. Or she, whoever you give it to. You know your taste of your of the kids. So just add what they like. If they're into marbles, add some marbles in there. If they're into Captain America, add a little Captain America in there. So there you go. Merry Christmas, you guys. And until next time, bye, you guys.